playing this song that was on my last folk album, the Doll's House album, and it's also on the up and coming radio series. Uh, the reason for this, one of the greatest vaudeville entrepreneurs, a man who took people out of vaudeville and made them into gigantic stars, his name was Florence Ziegfeld. And he took a chance in 1927 and put on a musical by Oscar Hammerstein Jr. and Jerome Kern. Now, he wasn't sure whether he really should put this musical on. In fact, it's up until the very night the musical went on, he wasn't sure. Uh, he sat out on the, uh, on the fire escape with his head in his hands, saying, why did I do it? I must have been crazy. I'm going to lose my shirt. Now, this musical turned out to be four and a half hours long. And at the end of it, the audience got up in mass without applauding and walked out. He was absolutely devastated. It's amazing he really didn't top himself. But the next morning, all the critics were raving about it. What had happened was the audience was stunned. And the next day, they were lined up, thousands of them lined up around the block to get in to see this musical. But this song, Florence Eco never liked. But he didn't want it to show, he wanted it dropped, but it's one of the most memorable. And for anyone out there that's ever been tired, especially in with your work. There's an old man called a Mississippi, that's the old man that I long to be. What does he care if the folks ain't happy? What does he care if the land ain't free?
in your show, woman. You find he's wrong and made a change. It's you, it's all easy, you ain't my baby. Thank you.